What is up, my big chickens? It's Jazzy McDonald here today, and today I'm going to be doing a uh, skit. It's going to be Christmas then and now. So yeah, let's get started. Then I want um I want a cotton candy machine. I I want an icing machine. I want a um I want another cotton candy machine. Um um I want Doritos. I want I want a new bowling ball. I want I want tons of candy. I want a um doctor said i wanna i want everything in the store um now i'm just gonna be a can't uh i know you can't afford it but all i really want is a camera and a uh computer so just give me whatever you want i'll like it or i'll dislike it I'll, it'll just end up it'll end up useful somewhere then we can't donate that. That's for me. I don't care if you want to donate it. It's mine. Now. Yes, donate it. I can get another one of those. Now. Wait, now? Yeah, just donate it. I can get another one of those, you know? It was like $5. You know what? Donate all my toys. I don't even play with all of them. Just take them. Donate them. I don't need anything. Just donate it to people that honestly can't have toys right now. And it's not their fault they can't have the toys. So just give it to them. I don't need it. They need it much more than me. I can buy some uh, something else. Then. Oh, it's only 6 a.m. Everybody wake up. It's Christmas. Now. It's 6 a.m. I'm going back to bed for like another three hours. Wake up at 9 a.m. Mm. I'm going to slowly get out of bed and slowly go to tell everybody that it's Christmas. Christmas. Da. Then... You know what? I really want a new cell phone. I'm just gonna go stick it in a cur like a wrapping paper. Right now it's 6 a.m. I'm just gonna go stick it in a new wrapping paper and pretend like I got a new cell phone. Now, I don't need a new phone. Honestly, the stuff has my life on it. It has every picture of family members. It has pictures of my friends that I obviously can't see now. There's a Corona. Christmas then. Everybody around. Every family everywhere. Still in our pajamas? Christmas now. We're still in our pajamas. But there's not a lot of family here anymore. I miss those traditions with just all of our fam my family coming together. Um, yeah. Um, so... When I'm get okay, so when I get bigger, I have like a few things I really want to do. What is this? I look weird. I look like a chicken. Um, but when you know I get bigger on YouTube, um, I really want to like just do like a donation thing around Christmas where like I have people raise money to um. One thing I really want to raise money for is cancer. Like, um, there's people on YouTube like Colleen Ballinger doing childhood cancer. I want to do cancer in general because I just like watch you know, all these movies and these people have cancer. And I just like look at them and I'm like, you're a hero. Like, I could never go through that. I would be so, so scared to go through that. Like, I'd be so scared if any of my family members went through that. I mean, I did have a family member that went through it. Uh, but I, I mean, I, she didn't never show it. She, um, hid it from us because we were kids. And I mean, she didn't hide it from us, but she just didn't talk about it because we're kids. It's, she doesn't need to talk a lot about that. Um, but I know if I were to go through that, I'd be really scared. If I, I were to see like a best friend, like there's Alexa and Katie, if my best friend were to do that, go through that like i'd be so scared for that too 
I know I could never do it. I could never watch anybody to go through it because I'd be so scary. And the people that do go through it, y'all are heroes. Because I don't know how you did it, but you did it. And, you know, or you doing it, you're working through it. You're a fighter, and so, like, I would like to raise money for the heroes in the world, because they're heroes. And, um, yeah. And then there's, like, a, not when I'm bigger on YouTube, but, like, when I'm older. Um, I have, like, this really great idea for, like, a Thanksgiving thing. And I just figured it out. So, like, I would make, like, a bunch of, like, turkey stuff or whatever. And I'd go out to, like, a park and have, like, a feast. And, it like, my family would be there, you know. Well, not really. A lot of it would probably be inside because it's cold during Thanksgiving. But I, um, and I'd have, like, a whole Thanksgiving, giant Thanksgiving meal. And, like, homeless people can come in and out and get a real delicious meal because that sounds nice. I mean, I don't really like Thanksgiving anything, but there's a lot of people that, like, love turkey, but they can't have it. Love ham, can't have it. I don't eat the rolls, but that's me. I'm not a very big Thanksgiving person. As you can tell, I'm already jumping straight into Christmas, so, yeah. But, yeah... I hope to one day get bigger and use my platform for something good and not just use it for my own advantage. I would like to use it for something very good and amazing to help others, you know. And I wouldn't even always do it on camera. Like, I don't believe in you, like, going and feeding the homeless but shoving a camera in their face showing how good you are. Like, okay. A hundred dollars. I'm going to go give a hundred dollars to each and every homeless person I see right now. And kind of like shoving a camera in your face. Like, is that your real feelings? Or is that just you pretending to be nice on camera? Like, do it off camera sometimes. Like, Taylor Swift does. She's like, she does so many good things that we don't know about. Because she doesn't tell us. Like, she um, gave someone money for like, to help with their college bills or whatever. We wouldn't have known that, except for the girl had to tweet it. Otherwise, Taylor Swift would have kept it secret. We would have never known about that. Never known how good of a person Taylor Swift is. And I want to be one of those people. Like, stop shoving cameras in homeless people's faces all the time. Just to show how good of a person you are. Okay? You can be a good person on camera for like five seconds. That's like a ten minute video. Be a good person in real life. Go feed the homeless. And I understand if you don't want to give them money. Don't give them money because sometimes, yeah, that's not good. Just go grab them a burger from McDonald's or something. Ask them what they want to eat. Go buy that food from the restaurant. You do not have to show shove a camera in their face and be like, okay, here, um, sir, 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 I'm going to give you $100. And then they're like, mm, okay. But you're not really a good person if you're just always doing it on camera. Like, if you do it on, on camera every once in a while, okay. But if you're not doing it when you're not on camera, what, what is wrong with you? Because you ain't doing nothing nice. You just happen. I mean, okay, so if it was you need help raising the money for it, like Colleen Ballinger is raising money for the Cancer Childhood, Childhood Cancer Foundation, and she's like, posting it on youtube like that's just her trying to get help from others like to donate like that's not her just shoving it in someone's face and being like here you go here's a hundred dollars and then off camera like i'm the rudest person in the world so yeah just do it off camera i would never do it on camera like that i mean i might occasionally like show you that i'm donating stuff like but i'm not gonna go shove it into someone's head face i'd be like, if I was showing you that I was donating stuff, I'd be, like, cleaning my room and then, like, having, like, a donation pile or whatever. And that's it. Like, that's the extent of it, of me showing my kindness. Like, you don't need to sort of see how kind I am. Because that's, I mean, you should see it. Because, I mean, those people that are doing that off camera, they, they're they the ones that need to be seen. They need to see be seen on camera because those are kind people. 
But, you know, you just know that it's real if they're not doing it on camera. So, yeah. Um, so I hope to one day use my platform when I get bigger of, as a YouTuber for nice things, good things. Um, yeah. And I hope to sometime when I get bigger to actually do giveaways. Like, so when I get like bigger on YouTube, I might like do Zoom calls with a fan or whatever. Because that'd be nice and... I mean, that's the least I could do. I appreciate you guys. Show my appreciation because, I mean, honestly, I wouldn't be here without you guys. Mm, you gotta appreciate your fans. You gotta appreciate them so much because, you know, they're the reason you're here. Like, honestly, without, I mean, I only have 300 subscribers, but each and every one of those subscribers subscribed to me. I didn't ask them to subscribe. They just happened to actually be a fan. I mean, I'm grateful for each and every one of these subscribers I have and yeah bye